Hello developers and welcome back! Today I'm doing another logo and this time it's the Elm logo with some animation and it will be the scale effect. So once again I'm using CodePen and I have a class named Box. In the CSS file I'm using SCSS and I have defined six colors. Then in the class box that we saw earlier, uh, the only important things here are the position relative and the red border that I'm going to comment uh, in the end. Now, inside the class box I'm going to start writing all my other classes. Uh, it's not very important this time to use class, you can use IDs, but I'm just going to use some classes because I'm used to classes. So the first class is body. And then I have the class purple, um, purple triangle, blue big triangle, and blue small top triangle. All these classes should be inside the class of body. So the outer class is box, then the inner class is body, and then inside the class body I have the three other classes that I've mentioned. Now. As for the body, you want a position of absolute and then some top left with height and this kind of properties. And of course, the animation will be with the name Elm Lago for one second and just one time. I will leave the animation for the end and I'm going to continue with the purple triangle. If you want to find the correct distance for the top and left, Maybe you should first define the width and the height. This will help you find uh, the top and the left properties. Now I'm using the CSS tool and I will leave it in the description box so you can use it too. And of course in the description box uh, you will also find um, a link for the code both in CodeSpan and in GitHub. Alright. So, as I, went, as I was saying before, uh, maybe you want to find your top and you know that the property of height is 80%, so you will do 100% minus 80% equals 20, and then 20 um, to 2 equals 10, so your top will be 10%. I think that I'm going to delete here the transform, alright. So now let's continue with our other classes. I want some classes with the color orange and some classes with the name green. And that's it, only five more classes. Once again, the triangle, uh, sorry, the clippy tool will help you make some shapes. And of course, you can do the same shapes with um, CSS, but this is a quicker way to do them. Be careful if you're using uh, Firefox or some old browser, maybe your result isn't the same. Here I'm using uh, Chrome, so I have this result with my shapes. The transform rotation here is uh, 217 degrees and I play with this value, I didn't know what was the correct one, but then I figure out uh, that it is 270. Alright, and now for the top, oops, I misspelled um, the property of bottom. Let me fix it. Great. Okay, and now we're getting almost ready. I don't need a transform rotation here. I will just use the trapezoid uh, shape and make a small trapezoid. Okay. Just copy and paste uh, the result from Clippy Tool, and now we are ready. Let's start. Let's start writing our keyframe with um, the name of Elm logo, and I will have zero, fifty, and one hundred percent. 
and then of course uh, the scale.